What's up guys? It is evening. I am already sweaty and it is time to build a three bin compost system. Who's pumped? My plan is to uh, to build this compost system right here. It's kind of a DIY approach and my goal is to spend as little money as possible. How am I going to do that? Well, come with me and I will show you. I found exactly what I was going to need for this project. Some old pallets. Check it out. It's good to have some gloves for a project like this. This is where they kept the hay for their horses, but uh, it's okay because hay makes great compost material, so we'll be fine. Doesn't need to be pretty. One more. Problem is they're not all the same size and I have no idea if that's important or not. So I'm gonna try to get the ones that are at least a little bit close in size. Green acres is the place. This one is too big. I have to get another one. Ew, I'm dirty. Oh, that's it. I'm still on the farm. Psych! All right, next step. You know what I just realized? I haven't played video games in like weeks. It's probably a good thing. All right, next, I'm gonna try to pound this into the ground with this. I've never used one of these before. I just bought it. Get ready to laugh. So here's the deal. It's evening. Uh, sun's about to set. This is really loud and I'm worried that I'm gonna be really really ticking off our neighbors Who I haven't even met yet if I start doing this right now as everyone's like getting ready for bed So I will come back at this tomorrow All right, it's a new day. It's the middle of the day So I don't think the banging noise is gonna be quite as disruptive to my neighbors. So uh, let's give this a shot That really works Cool. So my next task is to wire one of these pallets onto this thing so it doesn't go anywhere, and then I'll start building out the rest of it. I have no idea what I'm doing. Well, I mean, that's not going anywhere, but it's not really very pretty. Ah, oh well, it works. Now I gotta try the same thing with, uh, with the rest of the pallets. Just wire them together. Hold up, I've got a better idea. I'm gonna screw these bad boys together. If I had the right size screws, I gotta go look and see if I can find something that'll work. Went to the hardware store, okay. Okay, that worked, what a hassle. <laughs> Let's go on to the next one. I'm learning that this, using a clamp, helps an awful lot. <laughs> the screws I bought are really cheap and so they keep stripping every time I'm trying to screw them in. Using the clamp means I don't need as much pressure. It works. Okay, so this is what happens when you use pallets that were all made separately and are not the same size or shape. I can't screw into this one because I can't get in here without some kind of tool that I don't own. So I am gonna go back to wire for this one. Tell you what, I'm just gonna put the rest of this project on a time lapse so I don't have to bore you anymore. Check this out. It's time for another one of these bad boys. Let's make some noise. This one is very old and rusty, so if it breaks and like shards of rusty metal go into my eyeball, it's my fault. Okay, here we go. I'm telling you, in a couple years, I'm gonna have a rockin' farmer's bod. That's a thing, right? Farmer's bods? <laughs> that is not very straight at all. That is not what I was hoping for. Okay, well, whatever. Good enough. Well, folks, there you go. I made a three-bin compost system. It's not 
particularly level and uh, I did have to make an extra trip to the hardware store which turned out to be completely pointless but at least it's really ugly so there's that no but for real I did this all with stuff that I scrounged around the farm stuff that was left over from people who lived here before uh, didn't really cost me much of anything except for those screws that I did not use but yeah it was a worthwhile project I'll probably come back here and put in some chicken wire on the inside to kind of hold all the composty stuff in there uh, but for now I think I'm gonna call it quits for the day I did something but here's the reason I'm even showing you all this stuff I don't know what I'm doing right but the fact is I'm doing it. Back when I started my nonprofit World Next Door, I had no clue how to do any of it. I didn't know anything about journalism. I didn't know anything about photography or writing. I just figured it out. And so here I am trying to start a permaculture animal rescue farm. And again, I have no idea what I'm doing. But if you do it, if you just make it happen, guess what? You start to learn along the way. So uh, let's learn together. Yeah. See you on the next episode of I Have No Idea What I'm Doing, But That's Okay. It's probably too long of a title, isn't it? Oh shoot, I just realized something. Hey Siri, how do you make compost?